Good morning and a very warm welcome to today's Reflection Section Assembly. I'm Mr Collings and today the AKS Lytham Amnesty Group will be explaining a little bit uh, to you about the work that we do. Amnesty International is a global movement of more than 10 million people who fight injustice. We campaign to protect human rights worldwide and support vulnerable groups. Amnesty began in 1961 when British lawyer Peter Benenson was outraged when two Portuguese students were jailed just for raising a toast to freedom. He wrote an article in the Observer newspaper and launched a campaign that provoked an incredible response. This was then reprinted in newspapers across the world. Only when the last prisoner of conscience has been freed, when the last torture chamber has been closed, when the United Nations Universal Declaration of Human Rights is a reality for the world's people, will our work be done. This was the famous quote of the Amnesty founder, Peter Benenson. Since 1961, Amnesty has grown from seeking the release of political prisoners to upholding the whole global spectrum of human rights. Amnesty's work protects and empowers people. We speak out for anyone and everyone whose freedom and dignity are under threat, investigating and exposing facts wherever and whenever human rights abuses happen. In AKS Amnesty, we use social media to spread awareness on the current issues in our world today and share knowledge on Amnesty International. We can use our platform to express our views and opinions and make sure everyone has a voice. You can help out by following AKS Amnesty and Amnesty International on Twitter. In the fundraising group, we are planning to do many things such as raising money for our campaigns in the future to help a, a refugee and so much more. In Amnesty, we are looking at changing the lives of people less fortunate and with fundraising, we can raise money to do that by doing bake sales, movie nights and more. We are planning to do little things that can greatly impact our school lives and refugees. We are always open for ideas or suggestions, as, as if you have any idea, ideas, feel free to come to Room 3 on Tuesday lunchtime to discuss them with us. The Action Group looks at taking steps to understand and raise awareness of various important topics, including the rights of refugees. The Action Group members have taken a course called Amnesty International Rights of Refugees, and we encourage you to take it too if you're interested in helping those less fortunate. The course will provide the knowledge you need to help refugees feel welcome, supported and understood. You will discover key details, facts and be able to think about the struggles of refugees with a new understanding. It reveals the rights that everyone has and stresses how important it is for people to know about these rights. Ultimately, these rights cannot be protected if we don't know what they are. The impactful story shared in this course makes you realise that people's suffering and anguish is something that we cannot fix individually. But together, we can join in this fight to help them and prevent others from going through the same distress. We can all make a difference and we can start by taking the first step. So be the change that you wish to see in this world and take the first step. The admin group at Amnesty is in charge of advertising the events led by Amnesty, like fundraising and charity events. We're also in charge of merchandise and the notice board outside of room 3. The merchandise includes amnesty badges that you will see us wearing, amnesty balloons, passports, stickers and even tattoos, all to support amnesty. Our most recent campaign was our clothing appeal for local refugees. We got a huge amount of donations that the refugees really appreciated. Thank you for all that helped. Thank you for listening to our reflection section. If you want to take action with us and stand up for our human rights, please join us on Tuesday lunchtimes in room three. Remember to be the change you want to see in the world.